Hello, hello. Whiskey Cactus here. Welcome, welcome. We are early. Half hour early. Because we're finishing up Fire Emblem Awakening tonight. How we doing? Alright. Let's jump in. We got we got stuff to do. Um, I don't remember if we did supports or not. I think we may have. Maybe. Possibly. We didn't. Alright, we got supports. Let's do the supports. A support with Karam and Lucina. Here we go. Now. I'm ready for today's training, Father. Listen. Before we begin, I have a question. What? No. no. It's something I'd been meaning to ask for some time now. Once this war is over, will you be able to return to your own world? I don't know. Even if it were possible to cross the bounds of time again, my world itself may be lost. Naga said as much before we left. Good. I see. Yes. But don't worry, Father. Once peace is returned, I'll leave you to your life. What? What? Why? But don't you see? I understand I don't belong in this time. I'll not have myself become a burden. <clears throat> Lucina, I never want to hear you say such a thing again. Huh? Father? Listen to me. I've told you before, you are no burden. You could never be a burden. No. But... I fear I'm not very adept at putting these sorts of things into words. But it's clear you need to hear something, so listen well. What? All right, I'm listening. Thank you. Lucina, I am so gr very grateful for you. Grateful that you were born, that you grew into such a fine and noble woman. Grateful you withstood terrible hardship and risked all you knew to come here. I haven't the words to express how much it all means to me. None save thank you. You're my daughter and my friend. You will always have a place at my side. Father, I... Thank... Oh, Father. It's all right, Lucina. There, there. It's all... Oh, God. That's... that's. I'm not saying that. We're not gonna say that. Let's not say that. Let's not say that. Sumia and Morgan have their A support. No luck today, either. I'm going crazy trying to remember you. I feel so useless. I'm just so... Why can't I... Huh? Come now, Morgan. No tears. B I... But I know I must have loved you just as much as I loved Father. I bet we had a million memories together, and the thought of having lost them... I feel like I failed you. Like I... Like I... <coughs> Morgan. S sorry, I guess I got a little carried away there. Uh, m my head. Oh. What? what? What's wrong? Mother. I... I remembered something. Just one tiny little memory, but... I remember. You were smiling at me, and you called my name. <laughs> yes, you looked a little bit older, but it was definitely you. Oh, thank you, Mother. I never would have remembered without your help. And hey, this is great. If I can get one memory back, maybe I can get the rest. It may take time, but I won't stop trying until I remember everything about you. Stand tall. Take all the time you need, dear. I'll help you out in any way I can. Right. Oh, thanks, Mom. Ah. That's so sweet. Well, um, you're not still upset, are you? Huh? Of course I'm upset. You started moaning and shouting out of the blue. Your mother and I were terrified. <sighs> Look, I am relieved you're alright, but what was all that about? Anyway, some kind of scripted stage acting? <laughs> I don't script anything, I'll have you know. It's entirely improv- <clears throat> I mean, it's authentic. I'm the chosen scion of warrior heroes across tide and time. You're not ashamed to spout those lines? That makes one of us. <laughs> ashamed? Ha! Far from it. Though I suppose I can't blame you for not understanding my bleeding edge aesthetic. After all, you are the product of an earlier, simpler time. Well, a future where everyone talks like you sounds a bit... Hey. Oh, Wayne, get down! Hmm? What? Your shoulder, father, you're hit. Archers in the trees. They fired on you, those craven dastards. We're outnumbered. We have to get out of here. Now go! <clears throat> right. <sighs> we lost them. We should be safe here. God's not again. Hmm? Why? Why did you take that arrow from me? You could have died. This is, exa this is how it happens, you know? This is exactly... Uh. <sighs> this is how what happens? <clears throat> oh, Father... Owain? Owain, are you crying? What's wrong? I... Uh, no, nothing. Nothing is wrong. It was just... Just more improv, alright? Just forget I said anything. 
More importantly, we need to get to that shul we need to get that shoulder looked at. I'll go get mother. Yep. Alright, I'll be here. Oh. Alright, so that takes care of that. We've got barracks. Let's do some barracks. Not much of import at this point. You guys don't have anything important to say to each other. You guys don't have anything important to say to each other. You might find something. What are you gonna find? Okay. Dark magic. What are you gonna find? Nothing. Great. What are you gonna find? Experience. Okay. Cool. So, um, I think what we're gonna do is we need to figure out the problem here of people who are level 20 and really don't have anywhere to go. I think we just put them through the same thing again, right? That's what we do. I mean, at this point, we're basically at the end of the game, so I think it only makes sense to just go back through. Although, for Morgan, she could be anything, right? So, maybe we do something else? But she's not going to get to a high enough level that's going to make a difference, so... Hmm. Do we just make her a paladin? No, I, I like her being a flyer. Because she can then do things. Like, fly over stuff. Alright, yeah, I think we just... I'm just going to put her back through Falcon Knight. If we were earlier in the game, I would consider... Um... Going through, uh new classes and stuff, but we're basically, this is the last stream, we have two maps left. I don't think it really makes much sense to do anything else. Like, yeah, I would have, um, liked to try out Bow Knight Severa, but I think at this point it's just, it's not worth the risk. Um, let's shop here. I want to sell any bullions that I have. Then we can... We're going to get everybody's uh, inventory squared away. Although, we'll do that after this next map. Well, maybe. I'm assuming we, we can. <laughs> kind of just assuming that we can. Uh, do we have any... Where can I buy second seals? Come on, man. <laughs> Where can I buy second seals? Can we make this not difficult? There we go. Let me just buy a handful of them. One, two, three, four, five. That should be plenty. All right. So, who else needs them? Uh, Severa. My fear is that if we put her as a bow knight, she's just not going to be good, right? She's probably just not going to be good as a bow knight. Well, I mean, she could be, but, like, what's it going to get her that she's not, like, she's already this good? How much better is she really going to get? I'm just going to put her back through hero. Put her back through hero. Let's just do it. There we go. Uh, who else? Who's next? You, same thing. You're just going back through Sage. I am curious what Dark Flyer Lissa would be like, but...
feel like if anybody could pull Dark Flyer, like as a flying mage, off, it would be Lissa. And then you'll go through Sorcerer again. Because why not? If it ain't broke. Nothing to fix. Nothing to fix here. Until I look at it. Okay. Good. Everyone else is just chilling. Yeah. Good. Good stuff. Okay, cool. Um, let's get the inventory squared away. Let's let's do it. So you have the Exalted Falkian, which you should equip, because it's probably what you're going to end up using. And you might actually be good with that now. That might be good. Here's a Noble Rapier. Robin is good with what he's got. Sumia. I'm going to bench that Javelin. And we're going to go find ourselves... Excuse me. A... Short Spear. Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe we'll find ourselves a short spear. Well, we've got a Rex Caliber here. Oh, Let's go on. ahead and scoop that Rex Caliber. Where the fuck can I buy a short spear? Oh, hello, we're buying all those things. Take your time. We're buying all those things. I got money out my ass. Dude. Dude, come on. <laughs> Why do I have to do this? Why do I have to run all over the world trying to find a specific item to buy? This is stupid. This is stupid. I know I've bought short spears in the past. At least I think I have. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I had to, like, pick them up off of people. I, I mean, I'm fairly certain I did, right? You can buy short spears, can't you? Well, don't make me Google it. It's such a waste of time. Alright, well, here's what we're gonna do then. Just take a spear. I have a, I have a spear, so just take that then. Take a spear. I have some short spears, but take the spear. The accuracy's not great, but she'll be fine. Cynthia is fine. You're fine. You're fine, I guess. I mean, you could. Yeah, take the tomahawk. That's good enough. She also has she has terrible axes, but I kind of want her to have good axes so that she can throw a thing. So, is that enough to get you to use a hand axe? Yeah, it is. You can almost certainly use a Rex Caliber or something, right? Yeah. It's pretty good. There's not really that many good dark magic tomes. Take that, that's fine. Bwayne. 
What are we doing with you? Guess that's good. That's fine for now. I think uh, what we're going to do is we're going to do the next map, and then I think that will take us to the end. I'm assuming we will have the opportunity to uh, restock and stuff between chapters, I'm almost certain. But here we go. Let's do it. This is it, man, to slay a god. Origin Peak. The fell dragon is indeed here. Remember, Awakener, the power I gave you cannot destroy Grima. I see. Can only put him back to sleep. It is you. Correct, fell blood. <laughs> so you know of my lineage. Correct. You possess power not so different from my own. <laughs> you must find some way to break this unholy cycle. Can't just keep putting Grima back to sleep every few centuries. Otherwise, we merely will his vengeance on our descendants. I may know a way. Hmm? Yes, Robin? You have some strategy? Yeah. The other me claimed the dragon and I were the same, yes? If I strike the final blow, he'd be killed by his own hand. Really? Robin, ingenious. Naga, will it work? Perhaps. But there would be consequences. Grima's heart and Robin's are inex inexorably linked. Dragon and man can no longer be separated. Therefore, slaying Grima would also cause the end of Robin's life. I realize that. I am ready. Lead me. There is a chance you could survive, but it is a small chance. It is small indeed. You have bound your heart to those of many others in this world. If those ties prove strong enough, they may yet keep you in this reality. Uh-huh. So you're telling me. One moment, Naga. You're telling me that I could be saved by the power of friendship. Is that what you're telling me? I think that's what she's telling me. My bad. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but I would not give you false hope. The chance you would live is insignificant. In truth, you will almost certainly cease to exist. Hmm. Robin would cease to be? No, we'll find another way. Crom? Wait. You're not thinking clearly. Think about what your sister would have wanted. Amarin would never have asked you to do this. What is one life when weighed way against millions? Stop it. You're one of us. You'll always be one of us. There has to be another way. We just have to find it. Promise me, Robin. Promise me you won't do this. <laughs> Promise to not sacrifice yourself? Nope. I'm so sorry. You have been so kind to me, Krom, always. But this is my decision. Robin. The time for deliberation is over, Awakener. The Grimlil have found us. Father. We're under attack. Let's see what we got. What we got. What we got. You know what? I am going to bail out of this. I just want to check. Uh, because I don't know that I have access. I won't have access to a shop. Um, let me just purchase. Before we go any further, I know that we have over here, we have some physics. I want to buy a few physics. And we shouldn't need any more men's, but I'll just buy a couple of them too. Uh, before we do anything else, let me just... Let's buy some elixirs. Okay. 
I think we're good now. I just want to make sure I have enough stuff. We'll, we'll distribute it later, but... Okay. Now we're ready. Don't make me sit through this whole conversation again. God damn it. Can I skip? Really? Well, we can we can do this. <laughs> we can do this. That's fine. Yeah. Really? Perhaps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perhaps we know. We know all of it. No, we got to find another way. We're going to find another way. We will figure it out. Blah 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 blah. I kind of feel like this is going to be really short. <laughs> I don't know. Are we going to curb stomp this map? All right. We get 15. That's what we get. So there's our team. Now we just got to set up the actual inventories. Now, I don't think this is the final map, but I, do I, I really don't think that we have an opportunity. It can't be the final map to... Grima is not on this map, okay? Right? <laughs> and also, Validar is not on this map. Well, I mean, we killed Validar, but that's fine. Like, there's no... this. It's not Aversa. That's not how it ends. Um, but I don't think there is a chance to go back to the world map. That's, that's my only concern. That's why I want to make sure we're good to go. Um, so let's make sure our inventory is set up. Uh, you should have fresh elixirs. We also have all this stuff. I mean, I don't know. Do I care? <laughs> Do I care that much? Alright, we've got Bolganon, Rexcalibur, and Arcfire. You should be good. Let's make sure you have an elixir. Everybody gets elixirs. Shit. Sumia should be good. Honestly, just get rid of this. Take your silver lance. And grab an elixir. Get rid of that. See if we have a fresh javelin. It's good enough. Honestly, take a brave lance. And you take a brave lance. They're the ones who can use it the most. Because these guys don't need it. Do I have any fresh silver lances? Yes, I do. You're good. You're good. You're good. You need an elixir. You need an elixir. Just make sure everybody's prepped. Just in case we don't have a chance to restock or anything. I, I'm thinking we probably don't, actually. Uh, rescue. Let's make sure you have a fresh Physic and a fresh Mend. I just bought some new ones. So you should be good with fresh stuff. And an Elixir. And actually, I want your speed up. Do we have any, like, speed wings? Take them. Take them. I want your speed to be high enough that you can actually do some stuff. Lissa. Vulnerary. The fuck is that shit? Take a fresh mend. Actually, do you have... No, just keep mend. It's fine. I was going to say, do we have a fortify, but I'm not worried. Super worried about that. Uh, take a fresh elixir. Now, I could hand out some of these other weapons.
Like, can you use a brave sword? Yeah. Actually, you know what? No. I was gonna say I should give that to Krom. No, I shouldn't. No, I shouldn't. Alright, steel bow, silver sword. Let's go with a worm slayer, just in case. It's Balmung. Mm, take it. Fucking take it. Who else is gonna use it? good? Nope, somehow I just totally skipped you. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Okay, um, so up front, I think we want our aces. Uh... Yeah. Then we can put you over here, you over here. Got you guys on either side. That feels okay. No, I think we keep our healers on the inside. All right. Yeah? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Here goes. Really now? Still at your little schemes, butchering Validar wasn't enough. Do you see what your great struggle has won you? Nothing. Master Grima has returned. The world's fate is sealed. Well, perhaps you simply seek a tender embrace here at the end, hmm? I'm not completely cruel, you know. Come, I have a kiss for each of you. Be swift, Awakener. Grima's servants will harry you to the very last. You must reach the dragon before it is too late. Defeat the commander. Alright, let's mark off our people. Who are the scary ones? You're scary. You're scary. You have 11 swords, it's also scary. I mean, everybody here is gonna be scary. But my biggest question is, who is a big threat to my flying units? Because that's gonna be important to know. Like, we've got a shitload of enemies here. There's a big map with a lot of people on it. So, we've gotta be careful. But I think, I think our team is pretty solid. I think we're gonna be okay. So we need to start baiting some of these guys in. I think they'll probably move in without me baiting them, actually. So let's put, I mean, we gotta send Noe to kill something. She can kill one of these guys, almost certainly. Yeah, 2% Two... <laughs> Two chance to hit back. 2% chance to hit back. Noe, you're gonna draw first blood. There you go. Severa, you got this. <laughs> Who needs Aether when you have Saul and Luna? She can go again. That's important. Alright, so Gaius, you can come up here and take this guy out, maybe. Ooh, you're gonna take a shitload of damage, but you're gonna dodge it, so it's fine. I 
Nicely done. I mean, he is still in danger. Don't get me wrong. He's still in danger. This is the end, friend. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so they get more moves. Put you here. You can take this guy out. No, I don't like that. That works. Okay. Easy enough. Let's have Morgan come up here and do this. Let's have Morgan come up here and pair up, and then you guys together can do this. You'll do it, though, because you will. See? See, told you. Told you they were gonna. Alright, I don't know who wants to try to bait this shit out. I'm a little concerned about it. Alright, let's put you guys here. You can all chill. Uh, well, we're certainly not going to have Alyssa bait anything. I think we can probably have Cordelia come up here. And bait. We can put Lissa with Cordelia, maybe. Or Libra. Let's put Libra with Cordelia. And then I think we can put Sumia here. And we can put Tharja. Robin, you can bait up here. We can put Krom with you. We don't have to pair you up, but we'll just do that. Uh, I'll put Lucina here, and we can put Elaine here. And then Lissa, you can... I, I want to keep you and Anna safe, because you guys are healers, and I need to make sure that you don't get killed. So let's see how this goes. I'm not super worried about Meyer. I think we're in okay shape with that. That's scary, actually. Okay. <laughs> so I, I know it's only 27%, but that looks like a much bigger number. That's gonna hurt. Gaius can't frontline. He really can't. Look at all those zeros. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, man. You can't come for Noe. What do you... What the hell is wrong with you? You think you can come for Noe? My dude. There we go. Look at you, Sumia. Alright. Not bad. Um, what do we do here? Uh, obviously, Elaine does not kill. Uh, you might, though. You might have, yes. Do it, Lissa. Well, that's that. Nicely done. All right, you need to be healed, but we Anna can handle that. Um, Sumia, who do you have with you, Tharja? All right. Yeah, you're gonna have to deal with both of these. You can do it. I really hope we don't take the hit. So let's let's instead let's do this first. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Can 
Can you just do it with, with your sword? Yeah, you're better with your sword. Okay. Works for me. Works for me. You gotta do it. And Libra's gotta do it. He's gotta step in. He didn't step in. That's not great. That actually puts a lot of people in danger. Noe, I'm gonna need you to bail us out. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's gotta. Noe's gotta come bail. Bail everybody out. I feel like there's gonna be reinforcements, so we're gonna have to. You know, kind of be quick about it. Take this dude out. That was tasty. <laughs> Come on, man. Dude, fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. I love you, but... This is like the battle at the end of the world here. She doesn't have a physic. Oh. Whoops. That's a problem. Okay, he's still in danger, which I don't like. Robin, I need you to do work here. Yes. Do it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Out of danger now. So we can have you go here. Go to the convoy. Scoop up one of those physics staves. And... Yeah, it's fine. And then you can use it to heal Gaius. Okay. Good. Um... Lucina can go here. Krom, I am going to want you to pair up with Lucina. And then... It's it's just the Meyer users, right? That are, that are around. Scaring everybody. Alright, everybody chill out. Thank you, honey. Okay. So we can start to move you guys in. I think we're gonna need people to team up. So, Lissa, I want you to team up with Noe. Noe, you can kind of swoop on in here and just kind of hang. Uh, oh, I don't really want to Wayne to be. Uh, I'm a little worried about this. Can we put you in the trees somewhere? Yeah, hang out here in the trees. Um, we need to move in and bait. This is a little terrifying, sending her in alone like this, but should get the job done. She can always back herself back out. But I want to get rid of this bow. I'm going to get rid of this archer. Okay, that makes things a little safer for everybody over this way. Now I feel a lot more comfortable bringing people in. Do the work. Nice. Okay. I don't really want Robin doing much like that. That feels bad. Um. Sumia, you actually, you know what? You can heal. Cynthia. Yeah. Why not? 
Why not? You have the option. And then you guys can come over here and start really kicking ass. Um, so Cynthia still has one more. She's probably not gonna get that done. She can come up here and take out this guy. There we go. And then you can come over here and take this guy out. Damn it. There we go. Just try it. Just try it. I dare you. You think my wife is gonna let you do any damage to me? You, sir, are a fool. Come get me. Come fucking get me. Yikes. It's a bit yikesy. There's a little bit of yikes. Not much, just a tiny little bit of yikes. All right, Elaine, you can handle somebody. You can come over here and bronze bow it up. You can't though, but you can. You can and you will. You'll do it. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Nice. All right. So, Gaius, you can't do much, but you can at least make your way in. Um, Robin. There we go. Nice. Lucina can start moving up. Uh, I think we can deposit Tharja. Go for that. Nice. All right, so we can move you here. Yeah. And we can separate and put you there. That feels decent. We can put you here. And I will, uh, I'm not gonna waste a physic. All right, this side of things I'm a little more concerned about, only because I don't see a good opportunity to separate people, but that's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll get it figured out. I bet it did. I bet it did. Come on, Libra. There you go. <laughs> there you go, Libra. Alright, let's deposit you here. And then that's it. Alright. So you're all miring. I'm okay with that. Because you're all going to miss. 
Mm. Don't love that. Don't love that, but I do love the miss. That's great. Yikes. Okay. Okay. We're being careful is what we're doing. That's what we're doing, is, is being careful. Careful is what we're being, he said, allowing a Wayne to take unnecessary damage. Um, okay, there's a lot of people over here and a lot of enemies over here, and that isn't how that works, <laughs> especially well. Um, okay, Severi, you're going to just come up here and just do work. Goodbye. Goodbye. Let's have you team up with... No, let's have Cynthia team up with you. And then you can bring her over here. Yeah, do that. Nice. Nicely done. Let's have you guys team up. You can come over here and do that. Okay, now all you guys are fired up for another round. You guys were also here. Um... Yeah, I don't want to waste a physic. It's just not necessary. Alright, what are we doing over on this side of things? We need to heal... Elaine. Nice. There we go. Okay. Noe, you, um, you can bait. And I don't want you to bait. I know they're all obviously going to go for a Wayne, but still, it's fine. Um, Severa, you want to take this guy out for sure. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, Sumia, you take this one. It was not even remotely close. Nothing about that was close. Uh, let's chill here. And just wait. It's just Meyer? Alright, I'm not that worried. Then go for Noe. You can't hit me! You can't hit. What are you even gonna hit? Yeah, right. <laughs> Goodbye. Good fucking bye. Alright, you might hit. Actually, you won't, and now you're gonna die. Look at that. Got another physic, which is great. Okay. So, we're getting fairly close to being able to take out uh, a Versa, which is nice. Uh, Libra, can you handle one of these guys? Uh, you can't. But you might get help. Yeah, I figured you'd get help. <laughs> That's not surprising. All right. Um, it's gonna. That's definitely gonna have to be Noe. Handling this. There we go. That's fine. She's got another one. 
Oh, there's these guys, too. We already dealt with those guys. They flew in already. Um, I think, honestly, can we just? Yeah. Yeah, we can. All right, what else can we do? Can we handle this? Yep. Yes, we can. Sure does. <laughs> Why the fuck not? We're just gonna we're just gonna take the take the experience. Just fucking do it. Let's get that level up. That level up might be all the difference. You don't know. Alright, so it's gonna have to be you. And it doesn't have to be... With the... Yeah, I was gonna say, it doesn't have to be with the Brave Lance. We can save the Brave Lance. Murderers, you'll pay for taking Master Validar from me. I will, will I? Goodbye, Aversa. She just face planted into the dirt. Into the dirt. <sighs> well, there we go. Dark magic. Well, we know who's getting that. Yikes, what was that? The Dragon's Call. Not the Dragon's Call. Anything but the Dragon's Call. Grima. It's all right. We can defeat him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> My lord. How does a man challenge a mountain? One step at a time, Frederick. <laughs> Where would we where would one even strike? The fell dragon has a weakness on the nape of his neck. But that weakness will be guarded by his servants. I can send you onto the dragon's back, but the rest is in your hands. Right. Then please, milady, and quickly, we would ask no more of you. Everyone gird yourselves. One way or another, this ends here. Alright, I'm gonna put it here. Okay, so we do actually have another chance to... Okay. Just wanted to make sure. I wasn't sure. I wasn't super sure. We can buy brave stuff here, which is fantastic. So obviously everybody's going to get stocked with brave shit. If they don't already have brave stuff, they're getting brave stuff. It's that simple. Because this is the final battle. Do I have a Brave Axe? I almost certainly do. Alright. Drop one of these... No, uh, just drop that one. And then take this... Uh, go go, go it here. Alright. Everybody gets brave weapons. When I say everybody, I mean almost everybody. You might not need one. <laughs> you don't need a bronze bow anymore. You can use an iron bow. Or an underdog bow. <laughs> I'm just taking an iron bow. Uh, okay. So, we're going to buy... I carry only the finest. Brave Sword. You're gonna get a Brave Lance. 
You're gonna get a brave lance. You have one, you're gonna get a brave sword. You're gonna get a brave sword. You're gonna get a brave sword. You can have Balmung. <laughs> there we go. Um, everybody's got healing items and stuff. We got physics. I just used one physic from you. It's not that big a deal. Um, honestly, you don't need the silver sword. So do we? Do we have like a fortify or something? Oh, she can't use it. Uh, it's shitty. All right. Well. Then take a mend or recover. Can she use recover? Nope. Okay, take a mend. Uh, that's fine. I think we'll be fine. I think we got we've got weapons now. Everybody's got brave weapons. I think we'll be totally fine, guys. Here we go. We're doing it. This is the final battle. Grima. Wretched son of Naga, you will be destroyed. Robin? Yeah. As ready as I will ever be, Krom. Let's finish this. Alright. There we go. We've got a Grimlil Paladin, level 20. We've got a Grimlil Sniper, level 20. Grimlil Great Knight, level 20. Grimlil Assassin, level 20. And we have Grima, level 30, with Expiration, which has a might of 20 and a range of 5, which is kind of scary. This is what? Nullifies Lethality and... okay. That's more than halves damage. So, we're gonna have to work hard to kill him, right? So, that's okay. He's the final boss, so it, uh, I'm not that. I'm not that like concerned about that. I think it should be okay. The question is, where are we putting people? Why is Basilio here? Oh, we get a sixteenth. Oh. We get a 16th. I guess it could be... Uh, is it going to be Rickon? Why would it be Rickon? Why would it be Rickon, though? What would be the point of it being Rickon? <laughs> I almost just don't want to bring a 16th. <laughs> could maybe try to bring Olivia. As a dancer. You have to keep her way out of danger, though. Now we'll bring Stall. He'll be all right. We'll bring stall. Um, we gotta we gotta arm you though. See, I didn't buy a brave sword for you because I didn't know that I was bringing you. <laughs> but I have silver swords, so that's okay. And you can probably also use one of these other swords, right? Like you've got Ellie Wood's blade. That's not even that good. Leaf's blade, superior edge. What's Superior Edge do? Huh. Alms Blade. That's pretty decent. You can scoop that. And... Yeah, you can't really use much else. Um... You can use a Lance, but you can't use any good ones, so... Alright, just take, and then just take a... Take a... Take. Take an Arm Scroll, actually. Right? And another one. 
Might as well. I'm not using them for anything else. Now, now he has sea level lances, so he can use things, at least some decent things, right? Like a beast killer or a something like that. A frames lance, that's fine. And grab a javelin. Mm, I don't have any spare javelins. Okay, well. You know what? It's fine. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. <laughs> take it. Just take a elixir, buddy. We'll we'll keep you safe. It'll be okay. Uh, who's up front? No, that's fine. That's that that works. Um, yeah, healers. Yeah. That works. Now, I don't think it's only going to be... I'm, I'm not sure if it's just gonna be these guys, right? Like, there's there's a lot of guys here, like off to the side, and they're gonna like start coming in and shit. I don't know if there's gonna be reinforcements and stuff. I just don't remember, but let's do it. I think we'll be okay. Forgot about that part. What matter of magic? Magic. Ugh, that was a damned catastrophe. He's weakened us all. He's too strong. Ugh. Cannot end like this. I won't have all our struggle be for naught. No, this darkness, the future is upon us. Oh, God's father. And... S and so it ends, Robin. See how frail these human bonds of yours are? How short-lived? How pointless? You have all thrown your lives away, and the result is the same. What? We're not dead yet. Details, details. <sighs> but yes, I suppose it's time I got you all off my back, so to speak. Permanently. No. No, you don't want this, do you? You do have a choice, you know. Doesn't have to be this way. You can still save all your friends. Become one with me, and we shall spare their lives. Refuse and watch as I rend the flesh from their bones. I, uh, no, Robin, don't do it. He's lying. It's a trap. Now I will have your decision. Will you save these worms? Will you join me and become a god? Submit to Grima? No... Do you think me a fool? You'll kill them anyway. Well, of course I would. I only thought you might want to leave your comrades with a heroic, selfless image. And so be it. Leave them with the final memory that you were their undoing. Robin. Where am I? Yes. Where your god wills you to be. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some fleas on my back to take care of. What? No, I won't let you. You still dare resist me? Then perhaps I should end you first. So dark. A sea of black. I have no final strategy. No cards left to play. He is one. Ah, I, c I can't see. 
I can't hear. I feel nothing. Ugh. Nothing. Hmm. Huh? I hear something. A, a voice? You swore to do so, remember? Now keep your damn word. Krom? Krom. Krom, I can hear you. What? No, you are mine now. The dragon's grip cannot be broken. It can be broken by the power of friendship, you asshole. Fuck out of here, Grima. Come back to us, Robin. Wake up, Robin. Only I get to oversleep. Oh, everybody on the team is going to talk to me, right? Robin, remember all the days we spent together. Up and at him, Robin. One dragon ought to be a piece of cake. I'm here. We're all right here by your side. I'm with you. I thought I was your favorite dragon. Forget... Or I thought I was your favorite dragon. Forget about Grima. Oh, you're definitely my favorite dragon, Noe. Don't you worry. The gods gave you to us. I do not believe they wish you taken away. Get up, Robin. No one goes down without my say-so. Right. You have earned my trust and my love, sir. Now return to us. You can do it. Robin, you can't close up shop on us now. You're talking in puns at a time like this, Anna. Are you serious? No, you don't. Heed not the dark, eerie call, friend. Summon forth the strength inside you too, Owain. You're not off the hook either. Come on, you can do this. You need to fight with us. Don't you dare move. If you don't come back, I'm never going to forgive you. Baka. <sighs> Father, you mean everything to me. I can't lose you again. Uh, I can hear them. I hear my friends. And my family. And my friends' families. Stop this at once. <sighs> Silence those wretched voices. Damn you. you are all powerless, frail, insignificant. You are nothing. No, uh Return to us, Robin. Your bond with us is stronger than even the fell dragon's might. Let's do it. I'm coming, Krom. Hold on. And there I am. I'm back. Now. Children of man, take my power. Rise now and face the fell dragon. And heal us back to full health, please. Thank you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Defeat the commander. It's time. Here goes. What a great track. What a great fucking track. All right, we're moving everybody in. Let's just make sure that we know your range. We need to know your range. Your range. You have a bow. Like, I don't know if, like how quickly these guys are going to move in. So you have to be a little bit careful, but I, I'm not super worried because they're, they're like outside the, the battle at the moment. As long as we put people in places where they're not in danger, we should be fine. All right, and we have to make sure that Robin gets the kill on Grima. Okay, we gotta do that. That is not optional. Krom can also get the, the kill on Grima, but we don't want that. It needs to be Robin. What a great fucking track. Alright, so everybody moves into the middle where we can get surrounded. <laughs> I mean, it's not that I'm like in a hurry. But there's no reason not to just kind of go forth into it and just fight, right? Like, I mean, yeah, we're going to try to be strategic and stuff, but they're going to move in. Now, we'll fight them as they come in. That's fine. 
but like we don't need to route the enemy and I'm not necessarily gonna do it if I don't find that it makes sense to Because he's, yeah, he's going to summon more dudes. Krom is the only safe unit on the entire map. Okay. Alright, so we need to be careful here. I don't want to team up with anybody. The question is, can Robin... No, he can't. Okay, I was going to say, can Robin get up there? Uh, I don't want to... I feel like we're not going to be able to take him out. Right? Not right away. So... Uh, first order of business. Krom, I don't trust you to not be paired up. Because you, the, you, if you die, then the map ends, and we can't do that. Uh, so first order of business, archers gotta go. Oh shit! No, that's a that's a short spear. Never mind. Um, Silver lance this man to death. Do it. And see, this is why gale force is so important. This is why gale force is so important. Hear my words, awakener. Grima's servants will be set you to no end. Dispatch him as soon as you are able. Once the fell one is weakened, a choice will await you. If Krom lets fall the final blow, Grima shall survive but return to his slumber. Right. So be it. If Robin strikes in Krom's stead, both his life and Grima's are forever over. Only in this way may the fell dragon be destroyed for good and all. The, f the final decision is yours. Thanks, Naga. Um, okay, so we got to be careful not to let people die here. We don't have to be careful of that. We don't necessarily have to be careful of that. But, you know, I, we want to not let people die. Um, all right, I want to have Robin and Sumia teamed up. So the question is, can we get up here and take him out immediately? Not even close. <laughs> okay. So, then we need to be very careful. There's no cover on this map, right? So, our weak units need to be teamed up with stronger units so that they don't die. I know I just said I wasn't going to do this, but I'm doing it anyway. Um, okay. So, what we need to do then is... Sumia, you can come over here and take out the... Oh, that's okay, we have, we have a Brave Lance, it's fine. Do the work. Okay, we're taking care of the dudes that are dangers to my flyers. Okay. So we need to make sure that flying units are not in the red zone. I don't really care about you, Severa. You can be okay. You're okay where you are. You'll be fine. Nice. I was nice. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna move you up here. I uh, really don't want you guys in super danger, so we're gonna put you here. I'm gonna have you team up with Stall. Stall's gonna come up here. I don't think he has any ranged attacks, but we can switch. You can... I mean, if not now, when, right? If not now, when? When else are we going to use it? What are we saving it for? Okay. 
I'm a little worried about Libra. There you go. Not that worried about Libra. You can team up with Gaius. Gaius can get up here and take this guy out. Maybe. He'll be fine. Damn it. I gotta be careful with Gaius. He's fragile. Lissa hasn't moved yet, so that's okay. You can come up here and you can... Uh, mend. This is a scary situation. On over here. I don't like how I've positioned these people. Um, we can have Noe try to come up here and, like, guard them, I guess. But I don't know if that's going to work too well. Uh, Morgan, can you handle this guy? Mm -mm. Can you deal with a Brave Lance? Yeah, you can. There you go. Four hits. Each one of them with a chance of... Ignis, or whatever other buffs I have. Alright, you can come over here and take this guy out. Hell yeah. Oh, shut the fuck up, Sevra. This is, <laughs> it is way more important to just get the kills now. Alright. Uh... Morgan, you can handle this. I'm going to preserve uses of the Brave Lance as much as possible. There we go. Okay. You can maybe come up here and start working on these guys. Uh, yeah, it should be fine. Again, you can have Luna or Ignis or whatever proc. Lots of opportunities. Sure did. Alright. It's gonna go for Libra. That's gonna be a problem. Yikes. We're gonna lose units here, I think. I think we might lose units here. Oh. Libra's gonna have a problem. As long if he's able to dodge, then it's fine, but. Just gotta be careful. I don't want my healers getting murked. Yikes. All right, but the fact that they're not dying means that he's not going to be super accessible. Damn it. I knew I wasn't comfortable with how this side was set up. Come on, Lissa, you got to dodge. Damn it. How are they landing all these, like, sub-30% uh, sub hit rates? Fuck. All right, that's bad. It's one of my healers. Okay. So. Oh, God. All right. We got to get everybody up there. We, just, we got to get everybody up there. So the question is. Can Morgan. Ugh. Have any range? All right. Okay. 
It's too important. The problem is my best units are the ones I want to get over to where the people are, you know? Alright, Severa can be good for cleaning up. Don't necessarily need her to go over to Grima. Man, losing Lissa is, is a problem. Losing Lissa is not good. She's too good of a, of a unit. Alright. So we can bring you over here. We can bring you over here. But you, just, you don't do enough damage. So we need a clearer path. And I am probably going to have to start sacking units. Which is not ideal. I, I gotta keep you guys out of danger, because if you guys die, the map ends. Oh, fuck. I mean, part of me just wants to, like, let these guys drop. I don't think I have much of a choice. You know? He was only blocking the enemy from getting where they needed to go. Ugh. I mean, that's that's how it goes. If, if units have to drop, they have to drop. It's fine. We're playing casual. They're not dead. Doesn't matter. Uh, you just need to get over here and, and heal yourself. And, um, I can bring you guys over here. I'll just put you here. And we just bring you guys in as close as possible. And probably next turn, we'll get an opportunity to start doing damage. Ugh. Yeah, I'm not worried about you guys dodging. I'm worried about you guys dodging. Alright, well, Anna's not worried, so... Then we're fine. We should be fine, then. If my characters aren't worried, then I'm not going to be worried. See, the problem is I see 30%, and to me that says guaranteed hit. It's not, but it just looks that way, you know? That's huge. That's huge. Gaius is pissed. <laughs> Lissa went down. He's just fucking pissed now. He gives no fucks. And there's more. Alright, but our units are in a much better position now. So, we can start... I mean, we just gotta start by doing damage. Right? You start by doing damage. He will attack, he will get four damage off, right? And that's how it's gonna have to be. I don't know if we can do it in a single turn. That's... that's huge. 
She's got a brave axe, right? Okay, she's gonna cut him in half. As long as she doesn't crit. I'm assuming he can't be critted, right? That that wouldn't work otherwise. Let's do it. Let's have Noe start. I am Grima. I am Despair. <laughs> You're scaring me so much. She does take the hit, but it's only 18 damage. And she managed to land all of them. So he's down to half health. He doesn't have vantage, which is important. Um, Morgan, what do you do with your Brave Lance? You cut him down in half again. I think that's worth doing. Yikes, we gotta be careful. We can't let... Yikes. Okay, he lives on two. We're good. As long as Robin is able to hit, then we're good. Then the, then the game's over. 91% chance he's got two opportunities. We got it. All right. Let's clean up. Not that it matters, but let's just clean up. I like the very subtle Fire Emblem theme song in the background there. Uh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> Alright, fuck it. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Let's just... I don't care. Let's just do it. Here goes. Robin is killing Grima. Made my choice. Return to me. Come. We are one and the same. And I've got my wife beside me. I have Sumia with me. And there we go. Right. Now, Robin, this is our chance. I'm going to finish it. Let Krom land the final blow. Absolutely not. No, Krom. Robin, wait, what? What, what are you doing? For once, I'm glad you and I are the same. Now I can give my life to protect those I care for. You would not dare. All right. I would and I will. The evils you would visit on this world are unthinkable. In some way, I... we share the blame. It's only right we meet our end together. And there it goes. Bye, Grima. Robin, no. <laughs> Thank you, Krom, for everything. Tell the others my last thoughts were of them. May we meet again in a better life. Thank you for voicing that. Robin, no! Ah, oh, gods, no! <clears throat> the war is ended, my friends. Never again will the fell dragon trouble our world. I owe you all far more than words can ever repay. 
especially Robin, who gave himself to save us all. To save all the worlds to come. Poor Robin. After everything he did for us. No. Don't cry, Lissa. We'll see him again, I'm sure of it. Remember what Naga said? That Robin would survive if our ties were strong enough. This isn't over. I believe Robin is out there. Somewhere. And I'll find him. If it takes me the rest of my days, I'll find him. You're right. He has to be out there somewhere. And we'll find a way to bring him home. Even if we have to search every open field in this whole stupid world. I believe the same, my prince. Robin is too strong to simply disappear. It falls to us to look after the realm until he returns. Yeah. Oh, Sully. She's a character. Robin had damn well better come back. If that blasted dragon truly got him, I'll be the one breathing fire. He made a noble sacrifice, and I know my nobility. And I know Robin shall someday return. Yeah. Robin's gotta be out there somewhere. How do I know? Hey, you don't question the vague. Hmm. I can feel it too. Robin is out there waiting for us. Though I surely will miss him in the meantime. Um. While statistically unsubstantiated, I have what layman might call a hunch. This hunch corroborates most of the statements made thus far. <sighs> oh, right. Callum. <laughs> Robin, I know you're out there. I know you're not gone. No one knows more about being lost and found than me. I wish he could have stayed with us long enough to see me grow stronger. But all the more reason to work hard between now and his return. He lives, I know it. Some people just aren't the dying sort. If Crom believes he's alright, then so do I. Maybe I can work out some new magic to bring him home. If he returns to us now, I might even consider making him tea. Myself. Do you hear that, Robin? Me, making tea. You should be honored. Let us honor Robin's regard for his warren. He was a true Togwal. And a true Togwal would not leave family behind. I feel he's out there. If Robin's anything like me, he won't check out just because the job's done. Gotta collect all the sweet rewards, right? Too many times now have I watched loved ones give their lives for me. I must hold on to faith that this time will be different. Oi, Robin. You daring to make Gregor celebrate alone? Gregor not rest until he drink you under table. Ha <laughs> ha. Robin's not gone. He's just misplaced. I'll wait a thousand years for him if I have to. Name. Naga has a way of sending a ray of light into even the de deepest darkness. May Robin find that light, just as he became that light for us. <sighs> he had better march back here and try again. I only send people off on my terms, or in a casket. Oh. There will be one less set of eyes on me as I dance. It feels wrong. Please come back, Robin. Please be out there somewhere. Oh. Minerva says she still feels Robin is of this world. Also, that he smells delicious, but that's neither here nor there. <sighs> this fucking guy, I forgot he existed. Hey, Robin, everyone's dying to see you alive. We're sick to death of death. That reminds me of a good one. Two risen, a wyvern, and a priest walk into a bar. <clears throat> we have won our future, but we are in debt to so many sad memories. I pray at least one of those sadnesses will yet be undone. Right. I swear my life and blade to defend this future you have won, Robin. If you can hear me, swear that you will help me do so. Right. He did what he had to do as the mark of a true warrior. He'll be back. I'd bet my sweet brown arse on it. <sighs> yeah, leave it to Robin to take responsibility for all of us. If he cared for us that much, I hope he knows how we still need him. Thanks to you and the others, I was able to- Who are you? <laughs> I was able to change. And I got more changing to do. I wants to- I wants you to see it. You've done so much for me and all of my many, many sisters. You're an extra special customer. I hope we meet again. I feel a soul straight and true pulsing in the darkness. The hero will return. 
No tears today. I know he'll be back. I'll just have to wait and try to smile. Oh, cry. He'll be back. I know it. In the meantime, I'll write the finest song about him that ever was. I am glad for our victory, but I wish it did not mean so sad a farewell. I still have so much to learn. Come back and teach me. Now I know what it really means to be a hero. But heroes always come back to fight again, don't they? Fool, why did you sacrifice yourself? I refuse to accept it. Return, Robin, or face my wrath, Baka. You showed me that I have a future, that destiny can be defeated. Also, I'm Batman. We have to believe we can alter destiny once more and bring him back. No. Father, you can't leave me now, not like this. I believe in you. Come back. All this death, no more. Please, you've, you've got to come back. The world is vast and full of potential unexplored. I shall devote myself to, re to discovering that art which might reunite us. No, this is all wrong. He can't be dead. He's out there. We have to be patient and believe. This is all wrong. We can't just leave Robin for dead. I'll wait until the end of time for his return. Robin put others before himself. No one can question his character. But his work is not done. He is still needed here. Robin has secured for us all the uh, for us all the most precious gift, a future. Now it falls upon our shoulders to protect what was given. I vow to give my all to healing the damage this war has wrought upon the realm. When Robin returns, I want him to see what his sacrifice brought, bought. Robin, if you can hear me, you will always have a place here with us. Remember that. Always. Roll credits. There we have it. I don't know if I can... Yeah, I can speed this up a little bit. Not much. Oh, this is a lot cooler on the th actual 3DS, because it scrolls up from the from the uh, bottom screen up through the top screen. It doesn't look as cool here. <laughs> We're seeing all of our battle data. I don't... Does anybody give a shit about this? Does anybody give a shit about this? I've never given a shit about this. I've played four different Fire Emblem games now. And this has never interested me. Alright, well. It's all going. There are a lot of battles. 26 chapter maps and, uh, what, 17 paralogs? <laughs> it's 42 maps, man. Jesus. It's a lot of them. Ah, well, it's been fun, guys. <laughs> I mean, I've played, I, I kind of, I almost, there's a part of me that feels like I've kind of been slotted in as a Fire Emblem creator, which is crazy, because I'm not. I should be slotted in as a Tales creator, really, above anything else. But I'm a, I've always been a variety content creator as far as streaming, even as far back as YouTube. That's why I say Tales, because I did so many Tales games on my YouTube channel. Um, but, like, it's funny because I started streaming with Fire Emblem Three Houses, and early on in my streaming, I did, like, a lot of... Well, okay, but pause that. After Grima's defeat, Krom was officially welcomed as Ulysses' new exalt. Queen Sully rode far and wide on his behalf. Her gallant and radiant figure... The envy of women everywhere. As Ulysses' new knight captain, Frederick took charge of keeping 
the peace and training new recruits. Tharja's rare appearances at the training yard sent terrified recruits screaming into the night. The words are coming up very slowly, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Virian returned home to Roseanne, where he was labeled a traitor <laughs> and a coward, or else ignored entirely. But his wife, Maribel, treated the people fairly and equally, and in time, they learned to forgive him. <laughs> what an ending. <laughs> what an ending for those two. Vake returned to the streets that raised him and was welcomed as a hero and brother to all. Still, he was no match for his wife, Olivia, whose modest but mesmerizing dances made her more popular by far. Can't imagine why. Stahl continued his service as an Elysian knight and led crucial missions across the realm. Cordelia accepted her husband, scatterbrained gaffs and all, <laughs> and the two built a happy life together. Well, what did Cordelia do, though? The poor, uh, oft-forgotten Kellum. After the battle was over, Kellum departed Elise for a long journey. Of course, it took Krom and the others several years to notice his absence. That is tragic. <laughs> fucking tragic. Lonk returned to Regna Ferox and served as Basilio's right-hand man. Cherch knit many wool caps to shield her husband from the bitter Feroxy winters, and, of course, a cap for her dear wyvern Minerva. So she just knits now. While continuing to study magic, Rickon realized how childish some of his actions had been. Muriel's intellect inspired him greatly, and together they unlocked the secrets of the universe. Well, good for them. At least Muriel gets to do something. <laughs> Gaius never lost his sweet tooth, though he ultimately returned to less savory enterprises. Lyssa always insisted on going along, and the two survived many a comically <laughs> dire predicament together. That's hysterical. I love them. I absolutely adore those two. That's that's f so funny. After the war, Gregor briefly sank into a life of excess. It was his wife, Pan, who broke the cycle and invited him to see her Warren, after which the two traveled from land to land as mercenaries. Yeah, that sounds about right. Many an unfortunate child. Noe is my, like, silver medal person. Many an unfortunate child found joy in the small orphanage Libra and his wife built after the war. Noe tried her best to take care of the children, but more often than not, they took care of her. That also sounds about right. Also, they were fucking so precious. After Grima's demise, Henry made a cold, clean break with history, never to stain its pages again. Okay, bye. <laughs> Didn't even remember you were here in the first place. After returning to Chansin, Seiri worked tirelessly with the other dynasts to secure a peaceful future for the Balmese continent. She was occasionally seen visiting her brother Yenfei's grave. She's a cool character. I wish I could, we could have done more with her. With Grima a done deed, Basilio returned to Ferox and applied himself to dethroning Flavia. If his army of champions failed, he knew he could always 
wait for little Lucina to grow up and lend her a mask. Yeah, you could. You sure could. After Grima was vanquished, Flavia returned home and did a marvelous job of whipping Regna Ferox back into shape. They say that each time a tournament drew close, she would ask Krom to lend his sword. <laughs> Donald returned to his tiny village and lived a quiet life with his mother. The end. <laughs> he never took up arms again. A blessing for which he thanked the exalt daily. As is correct, Donald. You you were nearby all the heroes. With nary a word, Anna left the others and returned to her free-spirited merchant life. She was later sighted across the continent, haggling with suppliers and beating down the cost of goods. Yeah, that's, that's uh, yep, yeah, sounds about right. Lucina disappeared after whispering these words to her infant self. Yours will be a happy future. Did she journey to another land or back to her own time? No one knows for certain. Owain tried set settling down in Elise, but ultimately set off on a lengthy quest to stay his sword hand. Oddball heroes matching his description continue to crop up in the local legends to this day. Inigo traveled the world, ever ready, with a smile or a solution when trouble started to brew. His services and performances were rewarded with the best currency, the joy and gratitude of others. Brady left the priesthood to become the world's scariest violinist. <laughs> his rondos were apocalyptic and his requiems so full of melancholy that everyone in the room, performer included, burst into tears. And so Brady invented emo. <laughs> Knowing her battle had not yet ended, Kiel set off on a new quest of self-discovery. Her sincerity led to much heartbreak along the way, but each painful lesson further hardened her as a warrior. Cynthia never gave up on becoming a hero and traveled the land in the name of justice. While she impacted the world of comedy more than the world of legend, people still loved her for trying. And that's all I could ever want as a father. Eager to shrug off any kind of intimacy, Severa began a solitary journey, but once a year she was said to visit her family and yell at them for old time's sake. <laughs> and then she settled down with Cynthia, and they lived happily ever after. Garome and Minerva set out for Wyvern Valley. Many saw the rider and mount through the years, though most described the man as distant and cont contemplative. Morgan's memory never returned, but she didn't seem to miss it. Later, scholars would speculate she had come from a different future than the other children. Well, that's interesting. Yarn traveled the world 
in search of a safer haven. A journey that was ironically fraught with danger. Nevertheless, he is said to have beaten his fears and lived to a ripe old age. Longing to meet his mother's intellectual standards, Laurent went on an expedition around the world. His curious nature led to many adventures, which he later put to paper in a rousing novel. Noir stayed with her mother after the war as her assistant. Interesting. Was she simply trying to protect her infant self from Tharja's curses? Or did Noir find solace with the woman who brought her into the world? Probably the first one. The Manakit Na still had many human lifetimes ahead and she availed herself of this time to caution future generations away from the mistakes that led to the return of Grima. Exhausted from the war, Tiki returned to the Divine Dragon grounds and slept for several days. Afterward, she was said to come down and visit the people regularly. And there we have it. That's all of them. We didn't miss anybody. Definitely didn't miss anybody. And the book closes. The end. There we go. Mom, we have to do something. Hmm. What do you propose we do? Uh, I don't know. I see you're awake now. Hey there. <laughs> there are better places to take a nap than on the ground, you know. <laughs> Give me your hand. Well, this all sounds familiar. Oh, there's no mark on it. There's no mark on my hand, huh? Welcome back. It's over now. There they are. Sumia was my best unit. Sumia was gold. Many wrote of Robin's legendary exploits, but accounts of his origins and character varied. Scholars, poets, and bards agreed on one thing alone. He loved his wife, Sumia, above all else. Sumia was my number one unit. Robin was my number three unit, and Noe was my number two unit. I'm actually a little... Uh, well, I guess I'm not surprised, right? I guess I'm not, because it's easy to forget once the children characters come in, but the, the first generation characters fa face so many more maps, right? So that's, that's certainly why. And let's not forget that uh, Sumia was a fucking nuke in the beginning of the game. But there we have it. That, guys, is Fire Emblem Awakening. So, as I was saying, um, I, I did a lot of Fire Emblem Three Houses when I first started streaming, so it kind of feels like I'm not, I'm not, I'm going to say the word pigeonholed. I don't necessarily mean the word pigeonholed, but, uh, like, as a Fire Emblem Three Houses creator, necessarily. So, you know, I've t I haven't played Three Houses on the channel in over a year. But I knew I really wanted to play Fire Emblem Awakening again. Um, and it was a lot of fun to play a different Fire Emblem game on the channel. Because it it's variety. And it's a game I've been wanting to play again for a while. I don't really like playing handhelds. So the fact that I could play it on my television. Which I didn't do. I definitely played it on a 3DS. Guys, don't, you know, it's not for legal reasons. Um, but, yeah, I'm 
so glad I got to play it again. It's been long overdue. And to have another, a different Fire Emblem game on the channel now is, uh, is really cool. Especially this one, because I really, really like Fire Emblem Awakening. Um, but, that being said, we've got some things coming up. I want to do the Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC. So that's what's going to be next. Um, that'll be the next thing I stream. I don't think it's going to take too long. I know um, the quests in that game, I'm trying to think, like they, they took me like an hour each maybe, and there's like seven main quests and three side quests or something, so it's probably 10 to 12 hours. So I'm going to guess it's going to be four to five streams, maybe six if we're really pushing it. So it's not short, but it's not super long either. So... I think that will be a good transition to do something a little bit shorter. It's a continuation of something that I did a while ago, over a year ago now, um, when we actually played through Horizon Forbidden West. Um, but yeah, we're going to do the Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC, and then after that, we're going to start The Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky first chapter. That game is massive. And that's why I want to do something short in between this and that. I think Trails in the Sky is going to be, like, an easy 20 streams, if not 30. Like, it, it, I think it's going to be in that range. That is a long game, and it's going to be a lot of reading, and I don't know how I'm going to deal with that yet. I'm, there's no way I'm going to be able to read everything out loud. There's just, it's just too much. I won't have a voice by the end of it, and it will take so much longer. So, I'll have to figure that part out, and I may just end up kind of skipping through some text... And you can always rewatch the VODs and pause and read it yourself. I'll read the important stuff. We'll, we'll figure that out later. I'm not going to worry about that now. But that being said, that's what's coming up, right? So we have Horizon Forbidden West, Burning Shores DLC, and then we have uh, Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky first chapter. Uh, as for what comes after that, I don't know because we're going to be playing Trails in the Sky for a while. That's going to be like a three-month game, probably. So... um. Got a lot of stuff coming up. We got uh, some action adventure, and we got another JRPG. Turn based. Dude, Trails in the Sky is great. The Trails combat is so good. I love it. As turn based combat goes, it's it's probably my favorite. Excuse me, it's probably my favorite of all. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything new coming out that I want to stream necessarily. Like, I'm not going to stream Zelda. I've said that before. I'm not going to stream Zelda. Um, if I ever do stream Tears of the Kingdom, I will I will stream Breath of the Wild first. Um, so I'm not going to stream that. And I don't think there's any other games that are upcoming that I need to stream immediately. Like, Trails into Reverie is coming out, but I'm not going to stream that until I've streamed every all the other ones. <laughs> I, we'll, we'll start a very slow journey through trails. I'm not, you know, I don't intend to have that done anytime soon. Excuse me, why the fuck is it shelling Sumio with Krom? That's not cool. That's my wife. Anyway. Um, yeah. So. That's gonna be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you to everybody who stopped by, who joined the stream at any point throughout Fire Emblem Awakening. I'm going to say, like, as always, it seems like we usually get one or two new people stopping in uh, every game that I stream, which is really cool. I don't know how people find me. I, I, I do not put in any effort to market myself. So um, however you're finding me, thank you. Um, and uh, welcome to whoever whoever's watching this, whoever wants to join in, whoever, you know, uh, th thank you. Thank you, everybody. Uh, whether you're watching live here on Twitch, after the fact on the Twitch VODs, after after the fact on the YouTube VODs, whether you lurk, whether you chat, whether you stop in, or whether you, like, watch the, whether you watch the VODs and I never even know you exist. No matter what, thank you, however you are consuming this content, which is, I, I hate saying it that way, but <laughs> however you are consuming this content, thank you very much, it's greatly appreciated. Um, so, the next stream, we're just, we're just gonna keep going, so it'll be Monday. It'll be Monday, the 8th, uh, 7 p.m., back to normal time, 7 p.m. Eastern, until about 9.30-ish. We're going to jump into Horizon Forbidden West Burning Shores DLC. We'll see how far we get. Um, I'm not going to, like, go out of my way to do all the little optional stuff. I will I will focus in on the three side quests and the main quests. 
That's that's what I'm gonna consider finished as far as that goes, um, because we didn't we didn't 100% everything in the in the normal playthrough anyway. But um, so we'll probably try to mainline the main quest um, and then do side quest stuff kind of here and there. It, I, I have to figure out how best to slot stuff in time wise to make it work because I know sometimes when I do some of those quests it's difficult to save in the middle of them. Um, so. Availability of campfires might not be uh, always super prevalent, so we'll need to make sure that I I, I don't want to be doing three plus hour streams, so <laughs> so we'll figure that out. But yeah, I think it'll be an interesting. Uh, I think it'll be interesting. So yeah, that's how it's gonna go. Hope you're excited for that. I know I am. I will see you on Monday. For that is. A very interesting looking Morgan. That must be male as male Morgan. <laughs> anyway, I will see you Monday. Now let's let's stop being distracted. Hold on. There we go. Uh, I will see you on Monday, 7 p.m. Eastern Time, until about 9:30 ish. Thank you guys, and uh, I hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope you enjoyed the series. Good night.